Hey guys, Brady here, and I just saw The Happy Time Murders. So The Happy Time Murders is a new Melissa McCarthy movie. Uh, it stars Joe McHale, um, Elizabeth Banks, and then a few color uh, color puppets, or or just technicolor puppets. I don't know. Anyway, so this movie, um, I was excited to see, but I was a little bit skeptical to see because I was so excited to go see. Uh, Sausage Party when it came out and that was supposed to be one of those like gimmick movies like oh it's an R-rated animated movie uh, don't take your kids and I went to go see it and like I'm so excited and I walked out really fucking disappointed with the movie and then I saw how terrible the, the reviews are for this movie it's like oh I hope this movie isn't terrible and this movie actually I really dug this movie I dug the crap out of this movie uh, it had me laughing quite a bit. Not every single scene had me chuck, had me like uh, laughing a lot, but they all. I laughed more times than I did in Sausage Party, and I think I laughed maybe like three times during Sausage Party. I laughed like at least halfway through this movie. Like, this is like an hour and a half movie, or just under an hour and a half, like an hour and twenty five minutes. Um, I laughed maybe. I laughed for like a good portion of this movie. It wasn't like Sausage Party. So yeah, uh, now that I got this Sausage Party comparison out of the way, let's go on to this. So this movie um, stars Melissa McCarthy. She's a uh, like a detective and, um, or no, she she was a partner to this puppet named uh, Philip Phil, uh, Phil Phillips, uh, which kind of sounds like the uh, American Idol singer. Anyway, um... And she, uh, they used to be a part, uh, a team together, and then something happened, and now they don't work through each other. It's a pretty cliched buddy cop story, except it's with puppets. And um, I, I enjoy this movie. People give Melissa McCarthy too much hate, and I feel like it's because of the movie Tammy. And I did not like Tammy at all. But Spy, Ghostbusters, wasn't that good. But the heat, and just like... Everything Melissa McCarthy, almost everything that Melissa McCarthy does cracks me up. Uh, the only thing that didn't crack me up that much was Tammy. Tammy was sold to be a comedy, but it was more or less a drama. So that's bad on their part. But I, I thought Life of the Party was really good. That came, that came out like earlier in the summer. And um, I really enjoyed this movie too. Um, is it a smartly written comedy? No. Are, they, are there some easy jokes? Yes. Um, I don't care if like... Some of the jokes were easy or not. They, if it made me laugh, and I feel like it did its part as a comedy, um, no matter what. Um, if I had, if I had to have an issue with this movie, there's something that happens uh, in the middle of the movie, and then, um, and it just confuses me because you're like, okay, how, how did that happen? You just see something like, how did, how did, how did that happen? How did what it, it it was just weird uh without trying to give anything away trying to be as vague as possible but yeah so yeah philip phil phillips and melissa mccarthy's character they're trying to solve like this, this case um uh there's someone going around killing the happy time gang it's a it's an old tv show that used to be on the t uh it used to be on tv um and then like all the uh characters on the show are now like washed up like they do drugs and all that other fun shit. Uh, one of them gets uh, pretty much bleach, bleaches their skin and gets uh, a nose job. There's jokes like that in this movie. They're just they're like they're just like uh, making fun of Hollywood and the glam life of it. And it it was funny. It was funny to see. Um, there were some puppet related jokes that were really funny. Not like the sex jokes. I'm not talking about that. But there was like this like this one joke in the movie involving. Um, a puppet getting punched, and he's like, he's like, he's like, you know, I don't have any bone in me, right? So you're just pretty much fluffing a pillow. That would, jokes like that is what makes this movie great. It, it's hilarious. Um, yeah, I'm gonna give, uh, I'm gonna give the Happy Time Murders three stars out of five. Uh, I really enjoyed this movie. Um, if you're a Miss, Melissa McCarthy naysayer, go see this movie. I mean. She is doing her best. I, I, I love Ms. Melissa McCarthy. I think she's a funny lady. Um, yeah, go see this movie.